then obviously you got your so it holds 500 bales so obviously we're gonna whatever dump them in there or whatnot and then I think you can get rid of the there so hide markers so now that's gonna disappear so I don't necessarily need a shed it doesn't look like so let's uh hide those and then while we're at it now we're back on Farming Simulator 22. Haven't played this in uh, quite a while. But there was a mod that just dropped that I kind of want to check out. So let's get this thing turned on. Get these workers hired to start finishing off. Attempting to plant this field, but... Usually I don't have much luck with, uh, workers. Am I turned on? Yep. Gotta figure out how to work this thing now again. So let's get rolling with this thing. And then we'll jump in someone else and try and, uh, figure this thing out. Because we got some, uh, anywhere pallet storage or anywhere bale storage, more importantly. I thought it was going to be a lot more epic than I thought it was going to be. Uh, but we'll see if we can still make it work. Because it's going to be... Well, first of all, we're on my map that I made. I'm calling it Spruce Acres. It's using Avon Valley. Just all the whatever placeables. And yeah, it's like really glitchy because don't play it for a while. And then the cash has to catch up and all that stuff or whatever goes on for that. So, it's supposed to be an Anywhere Pallet Storage mod. Uh, so we, you can use, instead of just getting a specific couple mods that are out there for pallet storage, you can use basically any shed you want to, in-game or modded, sh modded sheds, and turn them into pallet storage. But then more importantly, it, it had, uh, by the side of the field, bale storage. So I got excited because I thought that was going to be kind of be one of those things where it was the same thing, pallet and bales, where I could stick any of those anywhere and uh, stick whatever I wanted them. So hopefully that's some kind of update that's going to come in the future. But there might be, I don't know if there might be a work run anyway. So like I already have a ton of ability to store storage and I don't even know if I have any, uh, do I even have any balers? I don't even know if I have any balers. Because I'm not particularly bailing. But since we have this thing, I'm going to try and... I'm going to try and use it. So it's going to be... Let's go under the construction mode, I'm assuming. I didn't even pay attention to where it's located when I was watching DJ's thing. But uh, is it going to be under containers, maybe? There's supposed to be a couple different, uh, no, it's not under containers. So, yes, yeah, so it's under silos. So we got any shed object storage, any shed object storage short, so for smaller ones, and then we have outdoor bale storage and field bale storage. It's going to be another small one. So let's, uh, first of all, but the thing is these won't allow you to, uh, do pallets. So actually, what am I doing? So what I actually want to try is the the pallet one. Not that I need. Well, let's just do a bale storage one first because I don't exactly need a pallet storage right here. So these little brown poles, you're supposed to. That's where you're supposed to line it up and whatnot, and then you get your icons, and then you're supposed to be able to eliminate your what you call it, your icons and whatnot. So what do we got going? We got the up fronts, oops, up fronts where the bales are gonna go, or actually behind in that straw area is where the bales are gonna go. And you're gonna drop them where the grid space is and pick them, whatever. I'm gonna stick it somewhere over here for now. So let's try and knock that down. And where the shit did it go? It's farther away than I thought. So we're gonna have this thing over here. 
then obviously you got your so it holds 500 bales so obviously we're gonna whatever dump them in there or whatnot and then I think you can get rid of the there so hide markers so now that's gonna disappear so all your bales and whatever will pop up over here drop them in here I don't know what is this oh, I think it just gives you so it just gives you two spaces to oh no decoration so I can probably does that mean that can I bring it back if I hide it though so yeah you can get rid of all that crap too but we're gonna I'm gonna leave that and just get rid of the grid so now I have bale storage if I want to do bales and do 500 bales but I wanted to see if I could do like the object storage anywhere like to be able to do pallets so like if I had whatever let's go over by the sheep pen and I want to try something first I guess we can just try to see if I can just plop the the shed storage things like just here anywhere on the ground and if that won't work I'm gonna try and like buy a shed and then plop down the shed thing and see if I can delete the shed and see if the pallet storage thing still stays there so let's get over somewhere here by the, the old cheapy sheeps because as of right now they just come up out of here and they're loading up into my uh, trailer auto load trailer so if I wanted to not use all those types of things then I could plop one of these things down anywhere I suppose so let's try the the pallets in object storage so any shed object storage so that's that do I actually need to have a shed or can I stick this anywhere I want to like that kind of like can I just plop this thing anywhere well if I wasn't standing there I could so it appears yes then I'm gonna be able to let me run my happy ass out of the way so I can stick it there next to it So yes, we can. So I don't necessarily need a shed. It doesn't look like. So let's uh, hide those. And then while we're at it, can we drop it off? scared to unload it because it's probably not going to unload it like that it's probably going to yeah that's what I thought Shed. Do you have a front loader on you? Yeah, but you don't have the... I have the attachment, but I don't have the front loader on me. So that complicates things. Because then i got to bring another guy over here to try and... Can I at least pick one up? Alright, sweet. At least I can pick it up. So they will at least figure it out. So do I drop it in? I thought I dropped it in here, though. No, I dropped it in there. Sweet! So yes, yeah, so you can stick those anywhere. Oh, I can oh that's right, I can lift anything, I think. So badass. That means awesome. 
So you got these any object storages, so I can stick these things anywhere I want to and hold 500 pallets of crap aside, whatever. I want to hold 500 pallets next to a sheep shed or something like this or next to my grape processing or like I said, I got a, we'll take a quick, so I got the coffee roasting and everything going on over here. Got coffee greenhouses. Then we're roasting coffee. We got grapes going on over here. There's a cereal factory up there in the background. Grape processing right there. Cow shed, obviously. Uh, pallet warehouse. Chickens. Um, I was just selling animals or something. And then dairy. We got, no, no, we got the sugar mill, carpentry, uh, like oil factory, I think, is down there. And this is where I was picking up the coffee. Yeah, same thing. We're back at the coffee place, back at the pallet warehouse. Uh, we just were here. Coffee. Cows. He's working. Hasn't stopped yet. That's good. Uh, this was my cornfield. It's m these fields are pretty gigantor. Some of these fields, at least, pretty huge. This is a uh, ethanol plant, so I'm doing ethanol with corn and whatnot. This tie is still guys still rocking, so good. And then we're back to the top. So yeah, now that that means you can. Uh, Basically, these any object storage, you can use any shed. Or, it appears now, you can just, like I just did, like I hoped, I can just plop this anywhere now and I can have, like, pallet storage anywhere I want to as well. If I didn't want to use stuff like this, like auto-loading trailers or, like, the big bags, which I have, a, whatever, 82 Studios big bags, I got a kajillion of those if I didn't want to use those type of things. Or then, that would be kind of more... I guess roleplay style, that's going to be cool for the the bales, because then now you can, uh, instead of just, I guess, doing it yourself and just dropping the bales next to the field like we always could do anyway, and then they'd, uh, I mean, they still won't rot, because it, it basically said if you're not worried about them rotting or if they're wrapped and you want to leave them up by the side of the field, you can do that, but we'll still do that, I'll still do that, and then, no, actually, now that makes me think about something else. I wonder if I could uh, stick kind of like a a roof over the top of this or something to keep it protected. Like what do we get for, I thought I had some of those like jets, like those overhang like style ones. Oh yeah, well, I forgot I even had these, I could, the one like make your own sheds. You might be able to just stick like, like part of a, one of these doodads over there. Get out of the trees, you. Like, might be able to do something like that. And then just, no, because then it's going to, nope, because you can't get it close enough. It's going to collide with it. I'd have to get it all the way out here. So never mind. Because it will, It'll collide with it. I was hoping that I could just stick kind of like a uh, a different style one over the top of that to cover it. But not if they're gonna rot if they're sitting out here out in the open when it rains and whatnot. But it's gonna look cool. So I could just do some random bales just to stick them there, just to have them there. But this was clearly just a video to uh, show you this mod. Can I still get in him? Yep. That was just to show that mod, so now these guys are in the process of uh, planting the field, and I got to debate to see whether I want to. Yeah, probably not. We'll sit here and wait for 10 hours for them to uh, complete it, or just quit and come back to this way later again at some point in time. But right now we got some of these. Uh, bale storages guys so that was pretty that's pretty cool 
I dig it. Pretty, pretty cool. So, all right, see y'all later. Bye-bye.